we got the Ring of Power. We got a new te main teaser that came out yesterday. And I wanted to watch with you and see what we see. So let's experience it together, huh? And here we go. There was a time when the world was so young. There had not yet been a sunrise. But even then, there was light. Now, is that a literal thing? So, for you guys that don't know, I love Lord of the Rings. It's like my family's favorite movie. You watch it all the time. Uh, but I don't know any of the um, background or like, I never read any of the books. So, so I'm just going off of Lord of the Rings here. Well, immediately it looks freaking phenomenal. Look at the detail. Now, these are just overarching landscapes. And I know that this show is like the most expensive TV show ever. But, holy mother. It looks really good. And that's a positive. <laughs> have forests to protect. Dwarfs their minds. Dwarfs their minds. Of grain. But we Harfoots have each other. We're safe. Uh, is Harfoot a family of Hobbit, or is that an, or is that a different type of Hobbit? I know that um, Smeagol is a different type of Hobbit, so it might be one of those. But Harfoot, I don't think they say that in the rings. Long enough, Galadriel. Put up your sword. Dude, it's Ned Stark from Game of Thrones. The enemy is still out there. It's the first person I've the question I know. Where? It is over. You have not seen what I've seen. I have seen my share. You have not seen. Oh. Now is this a flash forward to Sauron and his ability to um, destroy, or is this something that's going to take place now? What I have seen. Wow. Darkness the legend will march begins. Over the face of the earth, it will be the end, not just of our people. Is it just me or the way ever since the Hobbit the noses of these dwarfs are so stupid to me oh I hate it but then like I feel like that was not a thing like Gimli that was his real nose right or they just made it look better but then there's also the other two dwarves who look like freaking humans so I don't get it I don't love that I'll be honest and is that ice that ice was kind of fake as I paused here the past is with us all. The past is dead. We either move forward or we die with it. This could be the beginning of a new era. That's sick. Getting some Game of Thrones vibes here with Daenerys. Oh, almost done. But I'm noticing a lot like. This is not this is not Rohan. This is nothing. I guess it could be like an old Gondor, with the silver. I doubt it. So I'm not, I'm not seeing much Lord of the Rings vibes at all, which I, I like. I like it a lot. I don't want it to be feel like Lord of the Rings necessarily. I want it to feel exactly like Lord of the Rings, but I don't want it to be Lord of the Rings. If that makes sense. The past is dead. And right here, we either move forward the boat water looks good, but right here. Die with it. I don't know. Like, look at the chalice there. Uh, not chalice. Uh, the fire pit. It just looks so untouched by human. It just looks like a prop, honestly. And I am just coming off of Game of Thrones. So I'm 
that's in my mind. And Game of Thrones just looks like real. This looks so fake. And the only way I would accept this is if they said, like, we have a brand new temple. And I bet, okay, it's sick. It just looks like a prop to me. This could be the beginning of a new era. And back to the hobbits. September 2nd, I'm down. Uh, I do like the ending. I like how they end with the hobbits. Um, it's like the best theme throughout Lord of the Rings. Is It's also, it's actually pretty similar to Game of Thrones as well with Tyrion. Um, but like, you know, small people can be awesome. And I hope that the hobbits have a... Well, whatever these people are. Well, they're hobbits, but... Um, I hope that the hobbits play a, a large role in this as well. And that it's not just a Baggins thing. I hope it's like a hobbit thing. That hobbits, even though small through their character, they are able to have a big impact on, on the world. And I hope that's the case. As They're, they're kind of leaning up towards that because they started with hobbits, right? I guess they start with Galadriel and the trees. Which looks like Elden Ring, by the way. And then they went to hobbits, I believe. Oh, right there. Okay. Well, anyways. Uh, that would be a cool theme. Um, but my initial reactions, honestly, not nothing is po popping out to me as like super exciting, uh, as most trailers don't really get me that excited, um, especially very broad ones like this. I feel like if it was just like a scene of a first episode where they kind of explain some things and I get to see the acting and the dialogue and feel feel it, that it would be a lot more impressive. Um, but really, all we can really pull from this as a first time watch is just the quality that they've put into it in terms of uh, the sets and it just looks amazing really but there's not much else to say because it's real we're gonna have to wait and see for how well the acting is the writing um, story arc and pacing see how it all feels but yeah solid I feel like it was better than the last trailer the last one was something I can't remember it was a little shorter um, but yeah, pretty solid. Not great. Just your average trailer, I guess. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bless you.